NCAA champion joins us now on the BMW Tennis Channel desk. Mackie, congratulations. Great performance out there. It doesn't seem like it could have gone much better. What, what did you like most? Yeah, thank you, guys. Uh, first off, happy to be back in California, uh, my home state. Been traveling a lot this year so far, so it's really nice to be at home and have some uh, family. Um, just really happy with how I executed out there. Kind of just started really well from point one, so uh, that's a good day. Man, I love seeing you playing so well. You know, you look back to 2019, you were you were close to around 50 in the rankings and then dropped down to 71, had some had some injury issues and so forth. Now you're playing the best tennis of your career, so it seems. Talk about your your perspective where you are now and, and if you do think you are playing your best tennis. Yeah, I would agree. I think I am playing my best tennis right now. I'd say I'm, I'm my most focused, uh, focusing on the right things, uh, working smart, uh, got a good team around me. So... Yeah, I mean, I'm just going to keep going with that. You know, I definitely had that tough injury, and then uh, COVID came around too. So uh, just happy with how things are kind of going right now and how the tour is settling. You made, a, you made a new coaching adjustment after the U.S. Open last year, a man we are familiar with, Mr. Robbie Ginepri, who I was fortunate enough to play with. He's a, he's a dog out there on the yeah. tennis court. I mean, that, that boy knew how to fight. What, what has he been able to bring to your game? I, I could see some, some similarities between y'all two games. Yeah, no, uh, so happy to have Robbie on my team. Uh, yeah, we've been working since after the U.S. Open. Uh, I think he brings a lot of really good uh, qualities to my game. Uh, and also just his attitude and his vibe. He's a really chill guy, but, uh, but yeah, he does get after it. Uh, <laughs> we work hard. We work on the right things, and I'm super happy to be uh, with him. Yeah. Mackie, we're watching Ben Shelton play right now over on Stadium 2 against Fabio Fonini. You've played doubles with Ben a, a couple of times already this year. What makes him so special, just 20 years old? Um, Ben's a great kid. I mean, well, I guess he's still a kid, uh, <laughs> but he's uh, no, we uh, hung out a lot the last couple of weeks, played some doubles together. We're practicing a lot. Uh, he did come to Nona, uh, what, the previous offseason. So I've been around him a little bit. I think he's just got really big game. I mean, he's got that lefty serve. His serve is incredible. He hits the ball really hard, but he's actually really smart. I mean, he's really smart. So I think he's uh, some really raw talent that we'll see thrive coming up. Well, now you're talking about one of the one of the great young talents on the tour. We've had some great older talents who have left the tour, yeah. and um, you know we've had some pretty emotional send-offs, especially with Roger Federer last year. But um, but you you threw up a, a, a very interesting <laughs> send-off to him, probably a photo he didn't expect. But um, it, it was this just a little uh, you know uh, suns out, guns out, or <laughs> or were you trying to compare your bare chest to his hairier chest? What, what's going on here? Well, first off, I'm hairless, but second, uh, <laughs> just had to flex a little bit on the gram there, I guess. But uh, yeah, just a nice beach day with Roger, you know. Um, that was back in Dubai when I did a training training block with him. Um, uh, yeah, just a couple weeks, so had a, had a good time. You know, flex on the gram. What, what's going on with those ankles, though? Look, look at the t look at the tan line. I have to say, my sock tan's a lot better than that now. <laughs> but that was that was at its worst, and that's that's just black and white right there. I will say, it looks like you're out angling him. You know, he, he's just got this. thing. You got the power pose there, the guns, everything. I mean, you I literally are putting go. Roger Federer in the shadows. <laughs> I was ready. Yeah, it was a good photo. Uh, you got Holgerun coming up uh, next match, seven seed here. Well, what, what's the game plan? What do you expect? Um, not sure yet. So I'll talk to Robbie about that. You know, I know, I know he's been playing some really good tennis. I've watched a little bit of him. I know he likes to rip the ball hard. He's very physical. So I know I'm going to have to bring that, um, in terms of exactly what I'm going to really focus on. I'll, I'll nitpick with Robbie, uh, coming up and watch some film. All right. Well, congratulations once again on the win today. Pleasure always to catch up with you and best of luck going forward. Thank you guys.